Welcome back to USA Meets Kenya and today I'm gonna be cooking a Kenyan meal this is originally a Kenyan meal that we eat a lot in Africa and it's a vegetarian meal that maybe if someone wants to take the recipe you can take it and if it's your first time coming across my channel and sure to hit the subscribe button so this African food is called githeri it's made with corn and then it's made with bean so you mix it and then you boil it and i'll show you guys how i season it so and then if you want to buy the corn and the stuff you just get them from walmart i got all of them from there actually and so this is the bean i'm gonna be using to make my githeri i have beans here actually and then let me get the corn. When you go to Walmart, ensure you get the, it's called Juanita's, something one, I don't know how to describe it. It's mix, it's a Mexican name, but it's something having Kenya actually. Cause I know most of the corn at Walmart just like sugar. So this is just like the Kenyan corn for the Kenyans who want to cook this. So I'm gonna get a pan. All right guys, so if you have your book note, you better be taking recipes. So the first thing I do is I washed my beans. It's just like, depends on how much gideri you want to make. So for me, I'm just making for myself and the kids since my husband doesn't eat gideri, he doesn't like it that much. So I put in like two cups of beans on my cooking pot. This is gonna be enough for me for like two to three days actually. So I said, if you're making it in America, you're gonna do it the way I'm doing right now, I boil the beans first since the corn I bought from Walmart, like the corn is already cooked. The corn I showed you guys is already cooked. So I'll boil the beans and then when the beans are almost ready, I'll add in the corn. So ensure you boil your beans until they're like very, very soft and then you'll add in the corn. So let's go get the corn ready while the beans is getting ready. And this is a very good vegetarian meal guys. And I'm boiling my beans on high heat so that it can boil quickly. This should take around not more than an hour to get the beans ready actually. Yeah. So let me go get the corn ready. All right, so let's get it into the corn. We're gonna be using a knife to open it. So I actually have a hard time opening this. I don't know if there's an easier way. So I'm washing my knife here first. So guys, is there an easier way to open these? Cause it always irritates me to use a knife to try and open these things. <laughs> it takes me a lot of time to open these actually. So do you guys see the struggle they go through to open them? Say what you wanna say to me now I wanna 
Oh. 